great. Like, the football was great, the food was great. It was kind of better than last year. things we're trying to do here, as Solomon City is part of it, but church too, is get people introduced to a wider circle. Islington's got this amazing diversity, but we don't always cross over. Sometimes we live kind of parallel lives. Yes. For churches to provide a place of calm for all kinds of people to come in and to feel that this is a special place for them. It was a spirit of the moment, catch your breath, kind of night. I love my family, they're all I need. I can never forget them. They make me succeed. It is fun and it's been multi -pod. I'll talk to Rhett more about for the future. Hi! Today we did a performance uh, based on Big Brother. What fame really is and what it really means to be a celebrity. The main question was like, why do people actually go on reality TV shows? So in the city is really just one way that we can show love for our neighbours and receive that love in return. It gives everyone a chance to participate in something um, positive. We know that when communities are connected, that crime goes down, that kids stay in school longer, that the kids stay out of trouble. It's an opportunity for people to come and, and be valued for who they are. Every day I see your face, my heart goes amazing wealth of talent in Islington we don't know about. They have the confidence to come here, they have the, the venue, they have the, the whole the production set for them. The quality is, is incredible. What we're talking about is empowerment. Yes, exactly. A lot of people tell themselves they have no power, but you can share power. Sometimes it's receiving somebody's gift that, that helps them to grow. I love that. community people live here, children from the whole kind of background. This is one kind of intergenerational work you're doing in here. I'm privileged to represent this area because we have such great faith communities in, in St Mary's Ward. Well, we have Soul in the City right here in my ward in the very centre of Islington. It just enriches the whole community. I wouldn't have it any other way. You've got my heart. This is really lovely because it's going on for several days and people will just roll up and meet each other. There's free things on offer. The opera is completely free. What is thrilling about Soul in the City is that it's such a strong community event that everybody gets involved in and engaged with uh, and has a terrific time. The events I've seen have been absolutely magnificent. And I think it's very important for keeping everyone's spirits up, especially in difficult times, to make everything worthwhile and to bring everyone together. What's lovely is the photographic exhibition put on in conjunction with the local newspaper. It's a great opportunity for young people to get some practice in photography. All it took was just one look, you got me hooked tonight. We were very busy today. We've done many hand massages, given no, away no, loads and no, loads no, of samples. We had a great day. I wouldn't have it any other way. These are very generous prayers. Someone prays that there will be peace in Syria. They're very powerful. My favourite part of the festival was spending time with young people, seeing all the, the life that they have and the, the energy that they have and seeing the positive side of that energy. It helps to connect people. I think that, that's important. What did you like best about the festival this year? This. Oh, thank you. There's loads of fun games. What was your favourite thing? The football. Well, having Rory Malone and the songwriting evening was really great, as well as the rap, that was really fun. Uh, and the talent show. This year's talent show, we had the majority of auditions and participants under 18, which was just a joy to see. It was yet another example of the children coming into their own and getting to perform to an audience of you know 250 people. some amazing people 
We've given away thousands of cups of tea, slices of cake, and we've made loads of new friends. I'm leaving soon, and you're coming to. There are communities up and down the country where the special place was the church. And I think it's very important that that remains so. A fragment of scripture, God's people are invited to seek the welfare of the city in which they live. So not just look after number one, not look after people like you, but try very hard to live your life in the way that the whole community, the whole city flourishes.